All right, so this is from 17 again, and what happens in the scene? Um, basically, we're having a conversation after I found out that um, she hooked up with my brother and then went on a date with him afterwards also. Right, and you're kind of like not happy about it. Yeah, no. And um, Mariah, you you were like, you guys were really, you guys are best friends, aren't you? Yeah. And um, Lauren, I, I assume you're kind of confused by what she's so angry about or what? Yeah, um, I just like, I didn't really think it was that deal because it was just one date and it's like really not that deep yet. What if and it was deep? What difference does it make? Why wouldn't she be happy? Sorry, is that again? Well, you're saying it's not that big of a deal. It's only been one day. Well, so what? What if it's been 10 dates? Why isn't she happy for you? And yeah. Him? Yeah. Um, well, I think it's because he's like not, he's kind of like a player. And she feels like if he takes me like away from her, then she'll kind of be alone. So it's selfish. Yeah. He's a player. So he's. So initially, I thought you were going to say he's kind of a player and she's out to protect you, but it doesn't sound like no. that's what this is about. It's very like, like dependent on everyone that she loves. And so she kind of sees me going away and it ends up like driving me away. What do you think about that, Marae? Um, yeah, I think she's pretty spot on with the fact that I just, my biggest reason why I don't want them to be together is because I'm afraid that I'm going to lose mainly her but also both of them in a mm -hmm. sense because we ha I have completely different relationships with both of them and if they date I feel like I'm just going to be like a third wheel got it okay let me turn off my camera all right you guys take a moment just take a moment to think a little bit about what's happened before the scene started where you're coming from and where does the scene take place you guys in the cafeteria okay and and is this is this where you're confronting her mariah or or what um we had a conversation before this and this is kind of and we didn't really resolve anything so i guess this is like yeah it was kind of like a fight beforehand and i'm like like what was that like and it's kind of like the awkward after fight because you didn't resolve anything mm -hmm. okay all right we yeah. go Ready? And action. Hey, how are you? Fine. You? Good. Hash brown square? You're being weird. <laughs> no, I'm not. I just offered you a hash brown square. How is that weird? <laughs> this isn't you. This is like a terminator version of you that i'm supposed to think is you but like i can actually tell that it's a look like something in the future to offer me hash browns and eat my brains eat your brains when does a terminator eat anyone's brains <laughs> stop bullshitting me nadine what do you want me to say you get drunk you hook up with my brother then you go on a date and you don't even have the decency to call me from the bathroom <laughs> you wanted me to call you from the bathroom that's why you're mad you always call me from the bathroom after dates okay but, but the circumstances you? were a little the circumstances were a little different with this so is he your boyfriend now like are you guys an item all of a sudden it was one date so it was a date <laughs> ah nadine I'm I'm not comfortable with this. I'm not comfortable with any of it. So then what do you want me to do then? I want you to never go out with him again. He's my brother. He's off limits. I don't like it and that's it. Fine. Seriously? Yeah. Seriously. Sweet. Another hash brown square? Let's see here. 
All right, you guys. Nice. Good. All right, you guys, you're done. It's really good. I loved it. Hey. Yeah, way to go. Uh, there were so many things I liked. So many. Um, I liked both of you. I liked both of your characters. I thought there was a, a great innocence to both of you. Um, it would have been really easy to not like you, Mariah, but I liked him. You know, even though you were asking this crazy thing, I really wanted to see the next scene. Like, okay, now she's not going out with your brother. How are you guys doing? And it's going to be awful. Like, just seeing you guys hang out is going to be a nightmare, I'm sure, if you guys. So, um, yeah, and I felt like um, you've, you've been able to kind of develop and hone and shape Lauren this innocence really well, you know? And, um, just keeping this warmth about you and not having that tone that we talked about, it's not there, it's kind of gone. So, yeah, and so it was nice too when you kind of, when she said the thing about the bathroom, you know, the ridiculousness of that and the way you played it was was cool. And it was just, and then watching you, Mariah, um, when you asked her, said, I don't want you going out with him. That's it. It's done. It's, I don't want, like, I bought that you were like 17, you know, and you just haven't learned like life lessons yet. So it was kind of like, okay, I, I, I can, it's not right that you're asking her in my opinion, but I can totally see you doing it. And I can see why you would do it at that age. So good job. I really liked it. I thought it was um, some of your best work, both of you. Really good. Cool. Thank you. Yeah. Did it feel good? Yeah. Yeah, cool. Got to find something new. It's really happy with what you did. Keep up the great work. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Way to go.